Greetings, everyone, and welcome to Truth Council 23 with me, your spiritual wife and sister friend, Truth Nunez, and our spiritual council. Welcome, my lovies. Welcome to this collective energetic channeling for the sign of Gemini. What is up, my Geminis who never lie? What's up, my Geminis? How's it going? How's it flowing, my lovies? I hope you're all doing great. Uh, thank you so much, my lovies, for joining us. Thank you for coming here. Uh, for this collective energetic read, keeping in mind uh, that um, everything is in due time and you are in divine time, my lovies. Um, and we are reading collective energy. So this is for a Gemini who is important to you or you as a Gemini, but we are reading collective energies. If you need a private read, you know what to do. You can look in the description box below to follow the Calendly link to see your spiritual shrink, my lovies, um, or in the uh, pinned comment. Thank you again. Thank you for coming here, my lovies. Thank you for your your likes, your shares, your comments, your subscribes. Thank you for your super chats. Thank you for contributing to this work. And thank you for coming here, my lovies. It really means a lot to me uh, that um, out of all of these uh, channels on this platform, these beautiful channelers, you come here. And I love that. Um, let's get started by honoring and thanking the spiritual council. I want to honor and thank my grandmama, Abuelita Gladys Nunez Malonado. I also want to honor and thank my grandpapa, Abuelito Felix Antonio Nunez, I invite you to do the same. I do honor and thank your trusted ancestors, those that protect and love and guide you. I honor all of the religious forces, all of the spiritual forces, all of the archangels, all of the natural forces that protect and love and guide us and have come together to co-create the space with us um, to the divine source, to the all, to the to this unconditional love and mercy where all of us come from uh, that loves us all unconditionally despite our backgrounds, where we've been, where we think we're going, our belief systems, our socioeconomic uh, status, um, our affiliations. God loves us all and God allows us to co-create this space and I give thanks to that eternal source. Amen. Ashe and Lakesh Alakin. What's up, my lovies? Um, let's get started right away. Let's see what we have for you for the next 10 days or so. The next waves that you are riding. Let's see what we have. Poseidon energy is coming in. Got Poseidon. For some of you, the seas, the water, travels, or something that has to do with waters or emotional flows for some of you. Deep emotions that um, are coming in for you to explore. Or maybe you are more in like a very reclusive state if you want to i notice that when i do these reads the zodiac reads the daily read ah what's up with this hand this hurts this hand hurts here what's going on with the hand for some of you being cautious especially if you're in colder climates um hand issues maybe for some of you you broke your hand in the past i'm seeing somebody had a hand cast and for others something about lancaster um and something about uh, something about a magazine um and for others um arthritis or things of the bones especially in the hands you could be feeling your hands quite a bit over the next few days that you're riding the, the next waves maybe hand warmers for some of you especially if you're in colder climates you need hand warmers or you're going to refill on hand warmers um for some of you there there are are deep feelings that you're trying to like isolate yourself with um, you're trying to protect a feeling you're trying to protect a feeling for some of you you're trying to project a feeling um, take a look at our daily read and you will be able to find a little bit more information there there's a bit of a cry for some of you there could be someone that's crying quite a bit or you're crying qu quite a bit and someone's lying quite a bit um, again, take a look at the daily read if you want more information. It's actually the next seven day read that we just published. You may get um, a few more details on there for you. Uploaded uh, November 30th. We are going into a new moon though. So, and we are also going into a new uh gregorian calendar uh landi okay for some of you london is coming in and monday um landi in front and in, in france monday and landi uh you're something about london something about monday in france uh, something about monday in french um let us see let us see something about a french bulldog for some of you 
there's a hidden enemy for some of you. Uh, the number 10, the number 7, the number 9, and the number 5. Uh, we have 7 of hearts and a jack of hearts. Bomba ekut. Uh, 7 of hearts energy. Uh, 7 of hearts new beginning, a reconciliation. Um, you have a pregnancy for some of you. If you have a pregnancy in your field, you will be learning that someone is pregnant with a little boy or someone's going to give birth to a little boy. We do have 7 of hearts energy, a new beginning, a reconciliation, a new friend for some of you. Uh, we also have jack of hearts as a brother, a friend, a son, a well-meaning man around you. For some of you, you could be getting to know someone new and it's a new friend to you, someone you're collaborating with. Uh, you're collaborating. For some of you, music or musicians are in the field or artists or artistry. Um, something about Etsy. For some of you, uh, artistic expressions, you can be collaborating with a well-meaning person. Male, female, take it how it resonates because we are reading collective energies, but you are in artistic flow. You could be decorating something. I'm seeing like uh, the centerpieces for for some of you for some of you something about your nieces are involved in a situation anyways a lot of collaborative energy and artistic expression of energy uh you could be collaborating to uh, create things like for etsy it's very like etsy like energy somebody can own a boutique Something's gonna be on fleek, my lovies. Look at those obliques. For some of you, you're working out, my lovies. Dang, my lovies. Dang. Go, my lovies. It's your birthday. Go, my lovies. It ain't your birthday yet, but so what? Uh, you can still celebrate. <laughs> for some of you, you're going on a date. And for some of you, it's gonna be like your birthday. You're gonna go on a date, and it's gonna be like your birthday. You splurging, my lovies. I'm seeing, for some of you, I am seeing like your birthday. Like, I'm seeing birthday celebrations. Uh, birthday could be significant for you. You're looking forward to your birthday, my lovies. It's not for a while, but dang already. <laughs> Are you still talking about your birthday for some of you? I am getting though like you're planning for a birthday. For some of you, you could be actually planning for a birthday around you. This could be your brother's birthday or someone who's like a brother to you or a friend or a cousin. Take that how it resonates. We do have something about Kelvin or Calvin. Something about Calvin Klein. Um, you do have uh, something about InDesign, a designer. Um, we do have... Uh, joy and happiness when it comes to distance travel so for some of you you're definitely traveling you could be traveling through fa uh, fanny something about your fanny pack something about fanny something about franny something about francesca anyways you got nine of hearts energy and king of diamonds you have uh joy when it comes to international travels regional travels for some of you if you, you're traveling through paris to get to somewhere else i don't know paris and london are in the field take that how that resonates for you Let's see what you're up to. So in this present moment, we have the gentleman coming out right away. For some of you as a gentleman or your partner, uh, take this how it resonates. They could be spending time with a sister figure, a friend, um, someone who works in law enforcement, someone who works in government, someone who works in the banking institutions. You have a sister, a daughter, or a friend made for some of you. You also have to visit a friend at the hospital. For some of you, you could be visiting someone who just had a baby. Yeah, the little boy. You know, boy, girl, take it how it resonates. It is coming in as a boy. Something about Linden. Something about London Bridge. Something about London Bridge is falling down. For some of you, you're spending time with children. Especially a little girl. For some of you, you could be spending time with your little girl. Or for some of you, we have a surprise here. And for some of you, we have uh, you have on your mind a date. For some of you, you could be dating someone that's significantly younger than you. Um, this person's not jail bait, but close enough. You're dating someone who, maybe for some of you, you're dating someone who just turned 18 or 19. You could have known this person since they were 17 for some. Take what resonates, leave what doesn't. We're getting a few different energies. Um, anyways, you're thinking a lot about asking somebody on a date. For others of you, you're thinking a lot about a child you have to spend some time with. You're spending time with a child. And for others of you, you're thinking a lot about something that you want to do that, that it's almost like doing something that's different from your routine. It's like for some of you, you're thrill seekers or something like that <sighs> i feel like i'm out of breath you're going swimming for some of you something about michael phelps is coming in are you going swimming my lovies maybe you want to do something new like for your exercise routine maybe for some of you you're usually not a swimmer or you're not going into a pool something about an olympic swimming team take that how that resonates um boom you could also be hearing from a youngster who's not doing okay. For some of you, if somebody is younger and they're pregnant, they could be struggling with a pregnancy for a youngster. Yeah, we got a queen of diamonds energy here. Boom, by good. Um, we do have communications about... Uh, for some of you, uh, a work from home situation is coming in. For others of you, you got vacation stays here. Uh, some type of surprise temporary stay somewhere for some of you. And something about you need some type of supplies... Um, 
For the females, you're thinking a lot about your home, your couple, your family. There's a betrayal here when it comes to a youngster in your family. You could be very uh, upset. I don't know. I'm feeling like there's such a cry in the in the throat chakra energy. It's like things that are not said in this present moment. There's um take this how it resonates. Wow. I know that through these uh, through these times for Sir, for Serta, something about Serta, something about Concerta, uh, something about drug testing. I know that through these times, um, people like to spend a lot of time with their the family they were born into, even if they don't spend normally, they don't spend a lot of time with their family. Uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Take this how it resonates. There is a female watching this in this moment and there's a weird envy between a younger family member and an older family member. Put it where it resonates. This younger family member, it's like they're living their life. They're going to go get drug tested. They could be starting like their first like it's like their real job. Their first real job is really sweet. And there's there's a family member looking at this sweet incident with envy. Someone has tattooed eyebrows. A Portuguese person could be significant. They're looking at this sweet energy with like almost a little bit of hate and a cry in their soul. Like, and this is, this is, that's what it feels like. It feels sad. It feels like this is almost like I would wish that this energy would stay away from this younger. This is how it feels like, like this younger energy. Maybe for some of you, this is what you're observing or, you know, you situate wherever you need to. Something else situate. Someone's very envious of somebody's like their achievements, their accomplishments. It's like I'm starting new. I'm starting something new. I'm young. I, I don't know. And someone would want to stress that. Someone has a lot of envy in their soul. They're so mean. They're so mean. Something about the shoulder lean. This could be somebody's own mother. Somebody has a lot of children. It's like you meet people through their lives. And it's like, for example, I was listening to this woman speak at, um, where were we? We were at a Chinese restaurant. China could be significant. And I was having, um, I was thanking the, the waitress and, and I was paying for my meal and the woman came in and she just came in to pick up takeout. And she said, how was your, like, you know, the woman was trying to make small talk with her, but I respected what she was doing, like from a customer service standpoint and, and just a human experience standpoint. And the female's like, my holiday was terrible. And he's, she's like, oh, I'm sorry to hear that. Why? She's like, cause I was cooking all day, this and that. And this is the energy that they put into like this, this ritual that's supposedly so, in, so important. Something about Sarah, something about sewing, something about Samhain. Something just feels really sad. Because someone's going to pick up on this. There's someone who's going to like communicate like, look, I got my, it's like, like they get their test results back from like, like concentra. It's like, look, I passed my, my drug exam. And it's like, we knew you were going to pass that. But it's like, I don't know, like be excited for me. I'm starting my life. I don't know. I want to cry a little bit. I'm moving on. Got to be strong. This is an older, bitter female. This is going to be somebody's older, 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 just like much older. Something about someone has a chip on their shoulder. This person likes to like destroy people's happiness. It's like, I don't want her getting too excited. It's like, like, and then this person makes excuses. I don't want it to get to her head. You don't celebrate her and you destroy her happiness because you don't want it to get to her head. I don't know. This feels, so there's a block here. 
eventually this is the type of energy so i remember when i got my first job like my first real job i always wanted a job when i was a child um i got to work at a friend's salon my mother's friend's salon uh for a little bit um i was like 12 at the time but i'm like this ain't no real job um but then i remember a friend of mine worked at Subway. I was 15 and 10 months, so I got my worker's permit. And I'm like, I want to work at Subway. Can you get me a job there? He's like, yeah, I can get you a job there. Um, my mom made me quit that job. She made me quit that job. And then she's like, call them back, call them back and tell them that you want it. And I'm like, okay. I called them back and the guy's like, no. He's like, no, this is the type of energy. Someone's going to do something really malicious because they're envious. Three, three aces. And this is like, you're watching this. For some of you, this is not you. You're watching this. This is sad. You could be someone's dad. Maybe you're not with somebody. Like maybe something about your F buddy. For some of you, this could be your F buddy. And you don't really have say over how they, they raise their children or something like that. Something feels really like heartbreaking. Someone's like, they're envious of their own child or they're envious of a child that's supposed to be important for them. This could be someone's grandmother. Someone lies a lot too and they spy a lot too. Someone says that someone has an attitude and it's not true. They are the ones with the attitude. This is an older bully, but, they, but it's like um, this person, they have like, it's like, the adult against the children's word that's what is coming in this is sad this is very sad eventually this woman is gonna make this person quit i'm just a messenger this was coming in they're gonna betray this young person because of their envy in their soul and they're gonna make up some type of excuse you can't work there because x y z q whatever they're gonna make up some excuse there's a lot of sadness in this family for some or in this group or whatever this is to you. Um, anyways, got to move on. Got to be strong. For some of you, you're thinking a lot about, again, some type of surprise. Um, you could be trying to surprise somebody at work or at their job here for some of you. For some of you, if you or your partner, you could be trying to surprise your partner when it comes to something and you want to do something nice for them. It's like you want to send them something to work or something like that. That's going to cause envy as well. But I mean, so what? Yeah, you have here something beautiful for some of you. Like you want to surprise your couple. You want to surprise your man or your woman. That's sweet. That's really sweet. That's really sweet. You have really nothing to worry about. Um, but um, that made me a little sad. That made, that made me sad. All types of people on this planet. All types of people on this planet. Someone has like issues with their the, something about a valve something about a valve in, in their heart something about i don't know somebody has issues on this side and something about a valve is coming in yeah at work you're gonna do something sweet at work or for some of you you could be receiving something really nice at work someone could be doing something nice for you at work um, or you could be doing something nice for your significant other at work. Uh, take that how that resonates. Or something about your brothers. For some of you, if you work with... Something about working out with your family members for some of you. That's going to be sweet as well. Aw, that's sweet. It makes me smile. I like that. I like that for you, my lovies. I like that for you. Let's see. Spirit adores you, my lovies. Let's spirit adore you. Oh, this one jumped out right away. Ooh, we got a marriage. Love and marriage. Love and marriage. Dooby 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 doop 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 doop. Okay, so you're focused on higher level commitments, higher level engagement. Ooh, you are focused, focused, focused. Focus, focus, focus. You're focused on higher level commitments, higher level engagements. If you are in a couple, you'll 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 find one. Okay. You'll find one. I don't know what that means. <laughs> You'll find one. It's almost like your partner is saying like, you're going to find one. You're going to find... For some of you, if you're single and ready to mingle, you'll find one, my lovies. Are you losing hope? No. Um, 
you'll find one something about the pope uh if you are single and ready to mingle you're gonna find one if you uh if you are something about ali something about allison if you are in uh, a couple you are doing great things are going well for you high honors when it comes to a situation there's lies when it comes to a situation for some of you if you're trying to leave somebody you're gonna find somebody else don't you worry about that we got the number 25 and we got the number three maybe for some of you a three-year period especially if you are in your mid-20s there's no rush my lovies there's really no rush um give yourself time to grow you're thinking he can give you wealth but so young <laughs> so that fun uh vietnam 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 not vietnam vietnam uh something about someone's become so numb i don't know someone's being a little melodramatic in a situation it's okay my lovies uh mid-20s you still got a, a long way to go. You got a long way to go, my lovies. A long way. Uh, let us see. Let us see. Uh, someone feels like they're imprisoned in the house. Someone's not doing too well over there. For some of you, uh, you will be learning that a friend is sick or someone that is a privileged lady is sick. And uh, this person is waiting on some type of money to come in. Uh, this person lives a life of sin. Okay, well, bye bye, coot, bye, coot, boom, bye, coot, bye, coot, boom, bye, coot. We got a gentleman here watching this, or a gentleman that is important to you who is a thief or is dealing with thieves, and something has to do something about Phoebes, something about Phoebe. And um, there's a court case here for somebody, um, or somebody needs to report some type of thievery that happened. We got, uh, a main male, a thief, and the courthouse. The number 23, the number 24, the number 1, the number 32, the number 42, Gemini Strong. Uh, the number six, the choice, the lovers, the number four, emperor, uh, work situation, and empire. For some of you being cautious with anybody stealing at work. Uh, we got the number two, secretly. Somebody kind of been stealing for a while from an organization and from a work situation. And we have a courthouse. We have the number three, Venus energy. For some of you, there could be a female especially like a manager or something that reports something when it comes to stealing maybe for some of you if it's not stealing like money it's like stealing um time resources i don't know for some of you there's something like that in the field take what resonates and leave what does not um love and marriage damn we got a lot of people we got the females watching this you are surrounded by a lot of people um we got a main man no for some of you definitely a main man uh for some of you you're dating someone who's like a friend um if you are in the dating scene there's like a friend here interested in you and somebody is like a community is behind this the number 39 the number 93 the number 13 the number 31 a scorpio could be significant for you a death of a situation you could be learning also the death of a gentleman in a community for some of you we got the number three this could come from your mother your mother or a mother figure can tell you that a gentleman passed away or is having a big ending in his life and nine energy we have the Vir we have the virgo the virgo uh, Virgo, um, the hermit, an older person, wisdom, investigation. There's a female who wants to give a rose to a gentleman. This could be an important female to you. This could be you as a female. There's a female who wants to give a rose to a gentleman. This is a female, for some of you, you could have been, or you're dating, or you're about to date, a female who was dealing with a thief. And something about Chief Keef. A female who was dealing with a thief. Didn't we say CK earlier? Calvin Klein too? CK. A lot of CK. Something about BK. Something about Brooklyn. For some of you, there could also be like, if you're out in public, you can also hear something about public, something about a restaurant, something about, okay, something about Restaurant Depot. You can also hear that um, someone stole from somebody, like when it comes to like being out in public somewhere and somebody like has like, they could actually file a report for some that's coming in. It's a bit about filing a report against an escort that's coming in as well for you. We got a lot of energy here. For some of you, a lot of people in your field. Very, very busy. Lizzie. But these people have heavy tongues. It's like, I don't know. Something about tonsil stones for some. Something about tonsil removal. 
we have a lot of activity especially when it comes to public for some of you right now is not the time to um lose your mind about any contracts here because you're dealing with thieves there could be there's a group of thieves as well a group of men for thieves or three men and a woman or i was gonna say three men and two women is it not an organ donor there's a gentleman who's a thief for some of you you're getting to know somebody and this person is coming to like especially if it's, if you're a man and you're like well off or this is like someone that you want to like get to know or this is like a friend this woman was dealing with a thief a gentleman who's a liar who was like important to her but he betrayed her he betrayed this female if you're entry an entry level something about an entry level This could have been in a work situation where somebody, I don't know, for some of you, it's almost something about a Winnebago. Um, this is like, for example, somebody has a position. I don't know. It's like somebody had to keep starting over because there were a group of there were a group of men stalking a female here for some. And they were betraying this person. This is somebody that you wanted to get to know or you're trying to get to know. Eventually, this has to go to court, just so you know. If there's somebody new entering your life, especially, um, this person's going to go to court eventually because these groups of thieves, it's like, even if somebody was like, I don't know, even if somebody was like, something about even Stevens, even if somebody was like starting over in her life, this person is way too qualified. But these men did something sketchy when it comes to legal documents. I don't know. It's almost like this female is way too qualified. It's almost like this female could be this wealthy man. Take this how it resonates. But now somebody has like a whole backing of a community. These men were still trying to track somebody. Because they're thieves. I don't know. Collaborating together. Take what resonates and leave what doesn't. Something about prostitution is coming in. Take what resonates, leave what doesn't. We got the warrior. Strength, skill, discipline, and toughness of will. Heroism, stoicism, and self-sacrifice in conquering the ego. I told you something about prostitution and trying to seduce this woman. Don Juan, positive spotlights your positive seductive qualities. We got this gentleman here who is a visionary in the reverse selling insights to the highest bidder compromising your vision to make it more acceptable selling insights to the highest bidder compromising your vision to make it more acceptable don juan spotlights your positive seductive qualities trying to seduce somebody so that they steal from somebody we got rebel in the reverse rejects legitimate authority out of anger rebels out of peer pressure or fashion or rebels so they're all patty labelle we got a storyteller in the reverse making up tales that harm others a female we got a shapeshifter in the reverse projecting any image that serves your personal agenda in the moment and we have a uh, child magical in the reverse. Pessimism, depression, and disbelief in miracles. Believing that energy and action are not required for growth. A whole community. Something felt sad. <laughs> Something feels sad here. Boom. This is what it felt like.
someone is not protected or a group are not a, a group a group it's a group they're not protected these groups of seducers that wanted to seduce the law somebody wants to someone wants to seduce the courts or seduce the law or seduce something out of clergymen um someone wants to seduce the law the law is here the law is here twice This female wants to hide behind, behind like something that she made up. She made up some type of story that harmed someone else or a group of others. This wealthy man is trying to like, I don't know, play whatever role needs to be in order for this whole community. This is a lot of people. Spirit's asking me to count one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Eight, nine, ten, eleven people involved in a situation. Some female is trying 